Hi there, Sophie Watson here helping corporate and entrepreneurial women to get back in control of stress and anxiety. So I thought I'd do this quick video for you because I've noticed over the past couple of weeks something that's been coming up with my clients and it's been coming up time and time again. And it's all about what we don't like in other people. And what seems to be happening at the moment is we seem to be getting a lot of this coming up. And actually what's what's going on it's a reflection of what's happening within us so those things that we don't actually like in other people this is going to shock you you may actually find that you have some of those traits okay and this is something that we don't necessarily want to accept or acknowledge so the more that we're actually fighting against these people and fighting against those things that we don't agree with actually that's partly what's going on within us we've got this inner fight going on so have a think about the situations that you've been in recently so for example one of my clients she said to me um about the way that somebody reacted to um, her likes and dislikes within food. Okay, now they thought that she was going to immediately try and convince them that what they liked was completely wrong. So have a think about that. That comes up time and time again. Are there situations that keep reoccurring? Do people keep taking what you are saying or the way that you're reacting in a negative way and actually just step back and think about your behavior and your views and what you're actually saying and how it's coming across to other people so this may be you may actually be the root cause of all of this angst because we actually have um, a choice in how we react to each situation so before you start getting annoyed with someone or irritated with or notice that you're getting irritated with someone just take a step back and actually think about that whole situation and think about okay have I reacted in this way in the past is this something that a behavior that I have do I react in that way towards certain um, beliefs and certain things that are said because the moment that you recognize how you actually behave and how you actually respond, then you can actually start doing something about it and you can actually be more aware of it and notice what's happening. So anytime that that situation comes up again, you can then go, ah, oh, now this is how I reacted in the past. Do I? again ah, I'm back again okay so I don't know how much of that you just got but um, basically when you notice how you are reacting you can do something about it you can then pay more attention to if that same situation comes up again you can pay attention to how you react this time and see Oh, I'm back again. So yeah, so hopefully you can then see how you are reacting and do something different. Make, make mental notes about it. Just start noticing these things that come up time and time again and notice how you are reacting to them each and every time. And then start tweaking it. Just try reacting slightly differently because you actually have control over how you react in situations. That can be shocking for people. You actually have more control than you think you do. So anytime that you see something coming up against you time and time again, and you're repeatedly getting these situations, it's a mirror, it's something for you to learn from. So just analyze it, have a look at that situation and notice how you're behaving, behaving and then you can change it. So I hope that's helped. If you need any more help, if you want further help with this, if you need to work a bit deeper and see where this is all coming from, then you just need to get in contact with me. Um, PM me on this page and we can book you a session, a free session in and go from there. So I can teach you some tools and techniques that you can start using every single day. So I hope this has all helped and I look forward to seeing you all again soon. Take care.